Hey guys, what's up? It's Charlie here and today we're going to be looking at what your nose says about you. Noses, we all have them. While technically we're all unique, there are actually 10 different types of noses. In this video you will find out which nose you have, celebrities who share your nose, and what your nose reveals about you. Be prepared to be shocked and be sure to check out all of the noses to make sure you know exactly which one you have. Before we get into it, leave a like and subscribe and comment I subscribed and I'll try to reply. Coming in at number 10 we have Roman nose. The Roman nose is characterized by a large bridge which can either be curved or bent. The nose is slightly over projected. This can sometimes give the nose a hook like appearance. People with Roman noses are said to have great leadership skills. They also have very attractive and strong personalities. Those with Roman noses are pragmatic rather than impulsive and think things over. This often leads to them being high ranking businessmen and women. They can also be very persuasive and sometimes even good at manipulating others. Notable people with a Roman nose include Ryan Gosling, well perhaps more so before his plastic surgery. Next up we have Nubian Nose. The Nubian Nose is identified by its wide base. Those who have a Nubian Nose are often curious and creative. They're open minded and are usually quite liberal. They have attractive, happy personalities and are very expressive with their emotions. However, their emotions can sometimes be a little over the top. This leads to eccentric or very emotional behavior from time to time. However, those with the nose are also very passionate and good leaders. A notable person with this nose is Barack Obama, and as the nose means you're often passionate and a good leader, I guess this applies to Obama as he's passionate about his country and a former leader of it. Next up we have Snub Nose. This nose is small and button-like. It has a slight widening and is typically seen as one of the most attractive noses. The nose means you're likely playful but at times immature. It also means you're athletic and like a sense of competition. A famous person with a snub nose is soccer star Wayne Rooney. And much like other notable noses on this list, he fits the criteria for his nose. Next up we have Hawk Nose. This nose is characterized by a small bend in the middle of the nose. The nose often has sharp edges and is similar to the beak of a hawk, hence the name. In medical terminology, the nose is called a polybeak. It's typically not seen as attractive and many plastic surgery cases start off with a hawk nose. Despite this, the hawk nose is a very common one. While it's not seen as attractive, those with it are often intelligent and witty. Actor Adrian Brody is a notable example of this, but then again, he is typically seen as attractive. Next up we have Greek nose. This is the nose most commonly found on models. The nose is striking and long, but elegant at the same time. It's often requested to plastic surgeons by aspiring models and those who want to change up their look. The nose often means you're funny and have a bubbly personality. A celebrity with this nose is Jennifer Aniston. And as she is known for her beauty ever since starring in Friends, it looks like she fits the description pretty well. Not to mention the many models, actors and other attractive people who have this nose. Next up we have Celestial Nose. Celestial means heavenly, which is likely why the Celestial Nose is one of the most attractive noses on this list. The nose is upturned and has a dent in the nose bridge with a long tip. This nose can either make or break someone's look. If the bridge is bent too deep, this can be unattractive. If not, surgeons agree it's a great nose to have. People with celestial noses are said to be optimistic and kind. They're also very comforting and have a sense of adventure. They dislike casual flings and prefer a strong, steady relationship or marriage. A celebrity with this nose is Zac Efron who is widely regarded as attractive, largely because he has a good celestial nose. Next up we have Tara Nose. This nose is named after TV presenter Tara Palmer Tomkinson. The nose is very rare as only 1 in every 4000 people have it. It's uneven and bumpy, especially at the edges. The nose has connotations with fun and an interesting personality. The nose is said to belong to intelligent people including geniuses, which may be one of the reasons why this nose is so rare. However, Tara has since had surgery to remove the unusual nose features. But the name Tara Nose lives on. Next up we have the Redknapp Nose. This nose is broad and large, but not ridiculously big. The nose can be perfect, depending on the face it's on. On the other hand, it can be less flattering. The nose is very sturdy. It's common as 1 in 40 people have the nose. Those with the nose are often sporty and fit, but are also materialistic and like to live in luxury. 
Next up we have Fleshy Nose. This nose is by far the most common on this list. It is characterized simply by flesh. Around 26% of people have this nose. Those with a fleshy nose are often kind-hearted and forgiving, but they can be emotional and sometimes eccentric, and occasionally let their emotions, good or bad, take over. An example of this is the Queen's husband, Prince Philip. Next up we have Duchess Nose. Sticking to that royal theme, this nose is considered to be the perfect nose by many plastic surgeons. It is straight edged, and is very defined and often attractive too. And what's more, it suits both men and women. Those with a Duchess Nose are often creative, spontaneous and lucky. Doctors sometimes describe the nose as the golden nose. This is because it's the most common one they're asked to replicate in surgery. This is because it's the most common nose they're asked to replicate in plastic surgeries. The the most notable celebrity who has this nose is also the person who this nose is named after, that being Prince William's wife, Kate Middleton. She is the Duchess of Cambridge, hence the name the Duchess Nose. So if you have the nose, then according to plastic surgeons, you're very lucky. And that just about wraps up this video. Check out the poll in the top right corner and you can vote for your nose type. But as always, thanks for watching, check out some more videos on screen right now. Leave a like if you enjoyed, and if you haven't already, what are you waiting for? Subscribe to Top 10s.